To the uninitiated, the sight of three small boys running around with nets in their backyard is strange indeed. But here in Downs, a small town in central Illinois, it's become a regular summer event. And for A.J. and Eric Boward and neighbor Matt Harvey, it's even become profitable. Despite appearances, A.J., Eric, and Matt aren't crazy. They're simply catching fireflies for cash. The boys are paid a penny apiece for the fireflies by a St. Louis chemical company, which uses the insects for scientific research. It seems that fireflies are a unique source of luciferin and luciferase, two chemicals that have been used in cancer research and in the search for extraterrestrial life. But A.J., Eric, and Matt have more basic concerns, like how many they can catch. I think it was Tuesday night that we caught 120. Yeah, Tuesday night. Now, what would that, uh, what would that bring you when you sent those fireflies in? How much would you get for those? A dollar twenty. A dollar twenty for 120 mm -hmm. fireflies? That seems like a lot of work just for a dollar twenty. <laughs> yeah, it is. Well, we got a lot of energy. Actually, it was Mother who got the boys interested after she had seen an ad by the Sigma Chemical Company in a local paper. She also made the nets indispensable for catching the elusive bugs. The company provides shipping cans and they also pay postage. The fireflies are shipped every five days and the boys get a check each time they send in a can. So far this season, the boys have caught about 400 fireflies, which means they have a way to go before they get the $10 bonus. That comes when they've caught 25,000.